guys, this is Ipop Pigs and welcome back to another video. In this video, I just want to talk to you guys for a second. Some of you guys might be wondering, why did you start YouTube? Why did you call yourself iPod? Some other stuff. So I just wanted to talk about it in this video. So, um, I just want to, so I'm going to start off with who inspired me, how I got the name of iPod, and then, like, why I do what I do. Um, so the people who inspire me, they're, I could name a list for a long time, but I want to name a few people that really inspired me. Number one, and tied for number one, is Jack Septicai. I might not know him. He has, well, I think lots of people know him by now. He has two channels, FoosyTube and Dose of Fousey. But he's known as FoosyTube slash Yusuf Ezar, I think I use my, let's say his name. And Jack Septicai, which is Sean McLaughlin. Um, if you don't know what Jack Septicai does, he's a gamer. And sometimes he does the occasional vlog or reading comments where he talks to his thing. I think I was an uh, audience. And then Fousey too, he's a prankster. But then on his channel, Dose of Fousey, he does vlogs. And then he has other channels like Gaming with Fousey where he does games. And Mornings with Fousey, which is a talk show. But anyway, um, those two people tied with number two. They inspired me a lot. Number one, Jack Septicai. I'll talk about him first. He didn't care who ever said. He used to get mean comments and stuff like that. And he he just ignored them. And then he became one of the be one of my favorite YouTubers ever. Um he he's really loud, he's really funny in my opinion. Some people don't like him. Sorry to you people there. Uh, I'm not going to change your opinion. It's just my opinion. Um, but yeah. And then FoosyTube. He he was a guy who was going through depression. And he had like suicidal thoughts. Um, and he rose above it. And then he's talking into this camera every single day. Talking to his... Brub bros, or as he call as he's calling them now, lions. Um, every single day, about his life and how he overcome his, like, loads of people have had depression, suicidal thoughts. I've actually had maybe once, but um. Uh, he he was seriously down and depressed. He even has like an addiction, and like he was overweight and everything. And he was he decided one day of his life, I want to change um, everything. So then he got out there. He so now, to me, he seems not depressed. He doesn't have any suicidal thoughts. Um, he's losing weight. And, like, he's one of my favorite YouTubers and most, one of the YouTubers who most inspired me. Um, so for second place, I'm good. I'm not really, like, doing second, but, like, I'm mentioning them in this order. But then I want to say the Radbrad. He's a gamer uh, who actually, um, I think he was my, one of the first gaming YouTubers I ever watched. And yeah, um, he just really inspired me the way he just comes out and he uploads a video every single day or even two or as many as he can. And he just has fun with it. He doesn't care whatever people think. Like, obviously, if it's advice or somebody, people will care. But like mean people, like the bad comments and everything, that's what I mean. And he was a uh, always happy and cheerful, and he and it seemed like all these YouTubers to me see, seem like they're actually there in the room interacting with me, even though I knew they weren't 
with me. With me. It's just, um, let me think some other people. Roman Atwood. He's a prankster and a vlogger. He's really inspiring. He always brings out funny pranks that always makes me laugh. Also, Vitaly ZDTV. Same thing, prankster and vlogger. So funny. Um, uh, the the list is endless for me, because there's so many people I could thank for inspiring me. Because I wouldn't be here before you if those people didn't inspire me. But anyway, <laughs> I've been blabbering on about this topic for too long. So now I'll say why I got the name Apple Plays. Um, I got the name Hypopace because, well, my name is Iman, and it's spelled A-Y-M-A-N. For you people who thought it was I-M-A-N, you are wrong. But, um, so the A and Y sounds like I. And before I knew about Android and stuff like that, I used to love Apple. And, yeah. Um, and then also some people started calling me iPod. And then one of my friends, who were also starting YouTube... It's Gunfire Games, if you, Gunfire, I mean, if you haven't checked him out yet, yeah, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, um, he, it was like, oh, why don't you use the name iPod? It kind of sends some good intros and stuff like that. I was like, sure. And then that's how the name iPod plays came. The plays part just, I thought I was doing games and stuff like that, so that's why. And why I decided to do gaming and all this. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to also... I forgot a few people in that list as well. So, also, Unbox Therapy and Tacrax. Those are two great people who inspired me to do the reviews. And soon unboxings, which you will see soon. Um, but yeah. Um... Yeah, they, they're they always happy and everything, and they release good content, with I, which I really love. But anyway, um, why, I, well, why do I do the gaming and vlogs and all this? First of all, I do gaming. That was my original idea, gaming, because I love games. Games is my number one favorite thing apart from you, apart from... Giving reviews, because I just love... No, apart from giving rants, because I love giving people my opinion. There's a spider right there. Um, and then reviews, because giving my opinion again about certain things. And then vlogs, just talking about my life. And then also YouTube, which I love watching videos. But, um... I because I love games. I had a love for games. And then ransom reviews brewed because I love debating and giving my own opinion about things. So yeah, that's my that's how the rants and all that came. And then vlogging, I just like showing people what I'm up to. And yeah, but um. So yeah, and then uh, I think that's about it. And from now on, in each in each video, I'll try in each video to give one inspiring piece of words. So first one: every foot you t every step you take is a step you take into the future. Every step we take is a step into our destiny, you could say. But, yeah, I'm not good at inspiring words. But anyway, guys, if you like this video, kick the like button in the face because I've been laughing at you. And remember, even though my name's iPod, I hate Apple. Peace.